What's going on everyone? Welcome to my first YouTube video. I have this beautiful axe here, but you didn't always look this way. I'm going to show you how I turned this rusty old bag into this nice piece of axe. With a simple method, no power tools, and no experience. These are the tools I use to restore my axe. Everything you see here I got at Walmart. With the exception of this, I had to get it off Amazon. Um, I went with a super simple method super simple tools that literally anyone could buy and anyone could do um, the sanding did take a while uh, I edited it out of the video a little bit because watching me sand for hours probably would have been boring same with the filing but uh, yeah I think it turned out pretty well so I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video <laughs> All right guys, here it is. I have finished sanding the ax head by hand. It still has little divots in there, but I think it gives the ax a little bit of character. Not too shiny, nice brushed look. All right, now the ax head is all sanded down. I'm gonna start removing this old tape. So now I'm going to give the axe an edge, and I'm just going to use this right here. I'm just going to keep filing it down until I get the edge I want. Okay, well there you have it, an edge. 
I don't know how well you can see that. Pretty sharp to the touch, so. Okay, I got the axe handle all sanded up. And now I wanna give it a little bit of color. And for that, I'm gonna use a lighter. But it has to be a torch lighter. This one I got on Amazon for like $15. And I'm just gonna char up the handle and sand away. Hopefully it'll give me a, a rustic, burnt look. Now that I got the handle looking like this, I am gonna coat it with some linseed oil. I got some linseed oil and a cloth. I'm just gonna saturate the cloth with the oil and then I'm gonna rub it on the handle and let it sit for 10 to 15 minutes. And then after that, I'm gonna apply another coat and let that sit for 12 hours. thing I want to do is add some paracord right around here probably down to about there cut some paracord and you want it longer than you're gonna need because it's always better to have more so what you do is you make a loop you make it a little longer than you want your paracord to go and you want the top of your paracord to sit and about an inch on to the axe head, like this. Stick this end through the loop, like that. And then you take this end, and you pull it up. And it should tighten. Cut off the loose end, and then you can, if you want, attempt to kind of melt off the edge there. All right, there you go. Well, guys, this is the final product. A simple axe restoration that literally anyone can do. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. In my next video, I'm going to be making a sheath for this thing. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't be afraid to hit the like button and hopefully you'll stick around for the next one.